Hey, what's up guys? This is Wasi from flamelinevisualeffects.com and welcome to my another brand new After Effects tutorial. Today we are create a very exciting tutorial, so let's see what we will create today. Okay, so first create a new composition, go to composition, new composition and uh, let's call this audio spectrum and I'm going with 1920 1080p, frame rate 30 and duration make it 3 minutes then click on OK. Okay, now go to project window and then right click and click on file then select all files and click on import. You can download these files from link in the description okay now select the bg layer and drag it into your timeline then again uh, select your audio file and drag it into your timeline then we will create a new solid layer so right click new and create a solid layer and rename it to audio spectrum and make it black then click on ok okay now go to effect and preset window and search for audio spectrum and then select the effect and apply onto our audio spectrum layer okay now audio layer select your sound layer okay let's ramp view this perfect okay let's change some settings start point set it 0 and end point set it 960 and uh, end frequency set it uh, 130 and frequency band set it 2000 and maximum height set it 1000 and audio duration set it 180 and audio offset set it minus 20 okay now go to effect and preset window and search for polar coordinates then select the effect and apply onto our audio spectrum layer then type of conversion set it direct to polar and interpolation set it 100 and side option set it side B Okay, again go to effect and preset window and search for mirror. Then select the effect and apply onto our auto spectrum layer. And change the X amount to 960. Okay, now select the layer and then go to effect then go to generate and click on four color gradients then change the color whatever you want then select these points and move it closer like this okay perfect now select the audio spectrum layer and press ctrl plus d to duplicate the layer and make some changes 
uh, frequency band set it uh, 150 and then maximum height set it 990 and uh, audio duration set it 142 and then thickness set it 1.7 okay and if you want you can change the colors okay now go to effect and preset window and search for CC light brush 2.5 then select the effect and apply onto our duplicate layer and intensity set it 400 and then again go to effect and preset window and search for glow and then select the effect and apply onto our duplicate layer okay now select this layer and press ctrl plus d to duplicate the layer then select the third duplicate layer and delete the glow effect and delete the cc light brush effect and change some settings of audio spectrum and display option set it analog dots and uh, thickness set it 6.5 scroll down and change the color if you want Okay, now select these two duplicate layers and put it below. Okay, now go to project window and select your logo and drag it into your timeline and make it bigger a little bit. Perfect. Okay, now create a new composition and rename it to music. then click on ok then select your audio file and drag it into this music comp then right click keyframe assistant and click on convert audio to keyframes ok now click on this arrow icon then go to effect and delete the left channel and delete the right channel then go to audio spectrum comp and select the bg layer and put it below and select these layers and right click and choose pre-compose and select move all the attributes and rename it to final then click on ok now go to effect and preset window and search for magnify then select the effect and apply onto our final layer then magnification set it 100 and size set it 1100 and blend mode set it none okay now copy this expression you can copy this expression from video description so please check this out then hold down alt and click on this stopwatch and here paste the expression okay our audio spectrum animation is complete press 0 to ramp view 